बॉयलर ड्रम इंटरनल्स पार्ट वन पर्पज ऑफ द बॉयलर स्टीम ड्रम एंड सेपरेशन ऑफ स्टीम एंड वाटर बॉयलर ड्रम इंटरनल्स द टर्म ड्रम इंटरनल्स इज जनरली टेकन टू मीन all the devices installed within the boiler steam drum this includes various types of steam separators chemical feed lines boiler feed water lines and continuous blow off lines purpose of the boiler steam drum in a modern boiler the steam drum can serve several purposes it provides a place for the storage of steam so that load increases can be accomplished quickly and smoothly it provides a place in which to install equipment that will separate water out of the steam before the steam goes to superheaters turbines etc it provides a place in which equipment can be installed that will remove impurities from the steam thus preventing these impurities from depositing on other surfaces such as turbine blades it provides a place from which heavy concentrations of impurities in the water can be removed via the blow down line it provides a place for the distribution of feed water into the water circuits of the boiler it provides a place for the introduction of water treatment chemicals into the boiler request it is hope that this session is going to be useful to you please press like button please subscribe this channel yeah lecture hindi mein bhi uplabdh hai separation of steam and water at low pressures the lower density steam has a strong natural tendency to rise to and disengage from the water surface in the steam drum the separation of water and steam in low pressure systems can be accomplished without the aid of mechanical separators as shown in figure as the pressure rises mechanical equipment becomes necessary 
the dry pipe shown in figure changes the direction of flow of the steam and water mixture and causes most of the water to drop back into the drum allowing the relatively dry steam to leave the drum the dry pipe is an early form of separator that is still found on some low pressure boilers in a modern boiler drum the separation of steam from the mixture delivered by the riser portion of the circuit usually takes place in three steps the primary and secondary separation removes nearly all the water from the mixture so that in effect no steam is circulated back through the circuit see the figure the third separation of steam scrubbing removes or reduces the amount of contaminants in the steam that leaves the drum request it is hoped that this session was useful to you please press like button please subscribe this channel yeh lecture hindi mein bhi uplabdh hai This lecture is dedicated to the loving memory of my late elder brother Shri Surendra Kumar Chadha